Welcome back to Alone in the Dark. Just stumble around here a bit. Oh, where? Oh, God, what did I do last night? No, don't make fun of the graphics or animation. For 92, this was awesome. All right, I'll give it a chance. Okay, you really, really Sorry. state-of-the-art stuff. This is exactly how you render I'm... a... <laughs> uh, what the See, fuck? this is why you always drain the tub after you use it. That, I think that was like from a that's like a big thing from a Scrub and Bubbles commercial. <laughs> no, you can't use the sting twice. <laughs> See, that's the Alone in Dark equivalent of a chain chomp. It like rears up and jumps at you, so you have to like run in, get an item, run out, and run back in again. Is the idea? I'm using the tub here. Yeah. Oh. Uh huh. Oh. Well, is the there music... some action happening that I'm not aware of? It's that's the it's the drinking music. It's time to get crunk. <laughs> He's like Popeye, but with liquor. It's kind of a poor time to be drinking. Uh oh. That's rumors on the door. Oh, oh that, we had a lamp. That lamp is, well, it's almost like a lights on in the room, you know. <laughs> That's how we did dynamic lighting in 1992, you see. Right. That's the thing, right? Let's just put that down. Good. What? Why did the lamp get a lot brighter when he put it down? It almost looks fake. Right. Forget, forget it. That was a pro throw. I'm so sick of everything. <laughs> and you're stupid. <laughs> and you're dumb. And, and here's for making me read that for eight minutes. And, no. And you ran out of booze. So here's the problem with Alone in the Dark too: is you have to get rid of your items because you have limited inventory. Right. But then they kind of litter the ground, and you run over them and automatically try to take them. Can you set traps for the monsters Home Alone style? Yes. Excellent. Oh, oh, we have a very heavy statue. That'll be good to throw. Can he throw it with the same power that he could throw that notepad? What is this music for? It's still going. <laughs> Whoop! Sorry, items. Anyway, up, just Butts will be on the edge of their seats during the item exchange theme. <laughs> All right. now, let, now let's show that monster what for. Yes. Now that we have a book. A brightness from afar. No, we just I did one of these. No. An account of his celebrated voyage to New England, 1824. Did Alice they really need to voice act like Cambridge. this part? Like the publisher oh, information? This was the Alone in the Dark was the first game that catered to the, the blind. Were much impressed with one's arrival in their midst. One Actually, this is the CD version that had the extra voice acting. I believe. Degeneracy. Mm. Some children showed one their queer hands. Hey, hey, hey! Uneven. Oh, right, ninety-two. You know, yeah. it was a Boston thing. Hey, the hands are queer. Oh, I see. A child has undertaken to reveal to one a most prodigious phenomenon of a natural order. I got bad news for you. I see a right arrow in the lower right. To the prodigiousness of the marvel, whatever it may be. I'm more afraid he's going to hit that back arrow by mistake. Expects it to be little more than an evening stroll. Notice though, every page is bookmarked on the left. Apparently. In the forest hereabouts, one will nonetheless go. Every bit of this lore is important. Well, to submit to such local enthusiasms. I feel like this is like I want to like the voice director was like, "That's your best, Sean Connery." So I can see where Resident Evil got its whole lore idea from. The files, right. And but you know, kinda of simplified it. And distant stars normally invisible mm. to the naked eye were clearly visible, glittering indeed with a strange intensity. The heavy clouds that had settled above the village had no hold over so, that place. Good astronomy in this place, got it. It would Damn be pointless it. to offer here the names of the constellations one perceived in utter... Having never played this game before, I'm trying to understand the, at the time, appreciation that it had. Um, I'm trying to appreciate that perspective, but it's here, it's challenging, I, is all. I, ha I had this game when I was 14. Okay. There are a couple creepy parts in it. Uh, I think it kind of gets a lot of appreciation now since it sort of beat everybody to the punch. On so it was the first of its kind in this particular yeah. genre, for lack yeah. of a better word? Okay. Like, somebody commented this is the crisis of its day. That really wasn't true. Like, we, we didn't go to school and talk about, oh man, alone in the dark. You know, that, that didn't really happen, you know? Unless it was just not at my school, I don't know. Was this game pre or post Maniac Mansion? 
<laughs> this is post maniac mansion. Huh. Well, I think my garbage judgment is justified. Such <laughs> a moon. One Whoa. lost count of the craters so sharply was their definition. Now, it, it did draw some inspiration from Lovecraft. Hence, you know, the bathtub Muppet monster. The jellyfish? Yeah. Oh, is that, is that what that was? That's what it looked like to me. Okay. Gotcha. I didn't... I couldn't really tell you. It had a giant mouth, though, you know, which is why I thought kind of like a Sesame Street chain chomp type of deal. Well, I think you can put... It's part jellyfish, just like that previous monster was part dog, part duck, part roasted chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Maybe that others have noticed the extraordinary nature of that Oh, good, this is it. How else could one explain the presence of that cross? I don't know. There's a lot of pages to go, but at this point, Carnby's even kind of... Oh, I thought you were saying, here you go, as in, here's something interesting, but it was just, it's over. Yeah, no. Gotcha. Uh-oh. Oh. I should make haste! Was that the monster that was spying on you when you came in? I don't know. Well, I know Stay away, I've got a very heavy statuette. Oh, what? Throw <laughs> oh, what? Oh, you were serious. Yeah, that's how you kill the knight. I... I think you can duel him too. I don't remember if he's unkillable. That's or what not. I wanted to see. Yeah, actually, me too. And That's I wanted to see him put on the armor. Mm mm. That's ghost armor. Hey, look, we're already back to the first floor. Not and enough emblems. There was a cool library scene, I guess, the long player skipped, though. But A cool library scene? I'll tell you about it at the next half hour reading. Does it involve segment. a I was gonna say, does the library scene involve a lot of reading? <laughs> There's um oh wait, the kitchen's here. So better... reading gauntlet. I hate journeys. I hate Steve Perry. Oh damn it! <laughs> I will stop believing. This sucks. <laughs> Alright, we got a big pot of soup. I don't remember what that's for at all, honestly. Um Probably no, to in... throw at someone and scald a monster? <laughs> The song play might have death scenes in it too, actually. So we'll, I'll, I'll stay. Maybe I will stay off of the library. Do you turn into bubbles? You do not. You get actually. We saw the death scene at the beginning when Emily got killed, and they dragged her to the basement, and then oh, like right. yeah. monsters took over the world. Oh, biscuits! <laughs> you feel, you feel more sober now. I think is what they meant. Hmm. Now let's find the fish and chips, and I'll be set. Oh, Jeez. be careful with that knife, man. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Jeez. Or, or two of them, I guess. That's not safe. Well, it was just spinning in the air. That's well, how I'm you know assuming the character was doing that. Oh, I see. Well, he's a private detective. He's trying to, like, revolver ocelot the knife. My beans. Oh, God, no. Beans. Hey, hey. you get away from my beans, bro. Close the door on him. It's a... F okay, as you can tell, I'm very hungry. On guard. Uh... Poor alien. I have studied well in the art of spazzery. You know how when you hit something with a sword, it, it sounds a like a whip. Yeah. yeah, 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 exactly. Of course. Well, that was interesting. But back to the beans. The treasure is mine, I guess. All right. Let's. See. Is it no. the tank controls that are giving him a hard time getting in there? <laughs> that was the best we had back then, I guess. Um. Let's see here better use our pot of soup here at this barrel of water. What? Oh, right. Okay. Okay. So what is that crap? Uh, coal. Uh, are we going to kung fu fight that coal? Coal. I think, okay. yeah. Oh, yeah, there's a box of shoes in the coal. We'll just, yep. We got our oil can and boom, we're out of here. It's a beautiful perspective, by the way. Okay. So kitchen, yes. Yeah, I think that's thoroughly explored. Uh oh, look, look, we're at item max. But you threw away the diary of a journey earlier. Make up your mind. Well, let's let's fill our lantern up so we can get rid of the oil can, okay. right? Sure. Just combine and everything and make a super weapon. Let's make sure we hold on to that empty oil can because that will be important. Nope. Ugh, it's full. I hate it. <laughs> You're no good to me anymore. Oh, hey. hey don't point the gun at yourself. <laughs> what? Fuck you, box! It's never gonna get old. And and you other biscuit box. Done. So I can see why this is appreciated as a sort of 
study of gaming history, because this is where the drop idea seemed like a good one in games. Well, you know what's weird is that um, Resident Evil, they they could have copied that from this game. I mean, that that would have been good. You know, rather than the like tantrum the whole, like, throwing of stuff. Yeah, yeah, I mean, rather than the whole item box thing, why not just angrily pitch things? Of course. At, at your feet. Wait, no, the door wasn't facing. Uh, all right, good enough. Whoa! <laughs> Look how quick he ran for that. <laughs> Say. Hey, arrow. We got three arrows. So did him. Uh oh. Oh shit! Purple spiders. Not the Never purple mind. Ones. Get away from our statue. Oh god, they're coming. Oh, wait up, man. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm going back to the kitchen where I understand things. So the hallway will close in on you, right? <laughs> no, it's just... It looks like it's designed for that. Oh, okay. Oh. Don't go in here. Well, you oh. can't be surprised at that. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a monster's dinner party. One of them moved. Oh, you see, um... Hang on, monster. Hold on. I got a pot of soup. You guys hungry? <laughs> Are you really gonna throw? Oh. No, we're gonna we're gonna serve them dinner. So are the other ones placing bets? Uh, I yeah, I guess so. Okay. No, wait, oh, he's just going to his chair. Don't interrupt our. Huh? Oh, you're the alien zombie waiter, or pretending to be. I see. That's the pot of soup puzzle. Hey, can I get water? Hey. Yeah. Oh. It was 92. Those are the best puzzles we had. It's oh, coming actually, out of... Yeah, all right. So this, see the smoke coming out yeah. of the ashtray? That's going to kill us eventually. Unless you shoot it. With an oil lamp. Yes. So you pour it out. Hey, reset before you put the water in. There you go. Well. Well, you should still leave, I think. Yeah, I, it still it's doesn't seem It still seems safe. rather unsafe right. here. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Just one more check back in the inventory should clear everything up. God, I hate that hallway! Run! Hmm. It's right. locked. It's locked! Okay. Ah! Ah! Ah, to the window! No! Alright, alright. Uh, okay, I'm in the for I could have just walked here, I think, but. We'll just explore this haunted house. So we. Mm -hmm. uh, Grandma, no! <laughs> what the. I don't remember this at all. I accept your challenge. Oh god, a pie. No. It, yeah. Peg, peg like George Washington. No, no, that's a pirate. Okay, I guess. All right, well. I like how is... the guy just rolls with whatever comes up to him. <laughs> a vast G. On guard. A pirate? Well, I guess. Repost. <laughs> we already had the aliens and the Muppet wolves and the, the bathtub thing. Can't you just offer to smoke I... a cigar with him instead of duel him? Are they just like, missing each other? Is he even a zombie monster? He just looks like a dude. He might be. With missing dude. limbs. <laughs> he might be a time traveling pirate. Pirate zombie. Oh. Do you know that this game was successful enough to spawn two sequels and two remakes? I heard the two sequels are much, much worse than this. Oh, they're out there. Yeah. Got, the truth is, when I saw, well, I was reminded of this game, I was kind of hoping we could go through two and three. But is there pre a presentation similar to this? Yes, very. Anyway, we found another key, so let's let's just run. No, oh no, this time we're more confident. No, never mind. I'm a badass. Here we go. Just take this window with me. I mean, oh a book. good. Yes, good. I was hoping there'd be a lot more reading again. Sweet. Demonia particularis. Oh, wait, we might learn something about demons this time. Uh, this is your summer reading. Ring publications. Good old ring in their demonology books. Ring publications? Is the book going to crawl out of the monitor? That was the 1920s vermin of, demon, of demonological uh, Wikipedia. Uh, complex operations to be followed in order to call those that sleep in superior dimension. Sleep in superior dimensions. That's how I feel when I hear this lore. I could they do mean that. The they mean dimension X with like Shredder and Krang. Oh, cool. Used amongst their number by adepts of the cult of the old ones. 
The sign also Did he just suddenly go German there like old ones? The of a servant of evil. Hmm. Arrow. The sign resembles a blessing. Oh, this book's only two pages long, thankfully. <laughs> well, I mean, couldn't you tell? Folded beneath the thumb. Whilst the second and third fingers the are... second page is a heavy one. It's like a double fuck you is, I think, what they're talking about. There's no effect on adepts of a certain rank with knowledge of particular... <laughs> Did you know that demons are very heavily regimented? I would have like, assumed as much, yeah. There's like a whole demon org chart is the thing. ...is not without considerable risk to the user. Yeah, they have managers, <clears throat> sub-managers... Entry level positions. <coughs> and those from without are at the top circle, I guess. Yeah. The haves and the those from withouts. Right. <laughs> Alright, that's enough excitement. We better save. What happens in the 666 playthrough? Don't ask. Mm. <laughs> I don't right. want to do that playthrough. No! Alright, let's keep exploring, uh... I like when he explores, he's just, like, groping around like he's in the dark. Oh, I guess hence the title. Alone in the Dark doesn't have a whole lot of dark. Memories. Well, how, how else would you read? Here are my Alone in the Dark favorite moments. Scrapbook for your pleasure. <laughs> Alone with your thoughts, really. Conversation with G. Homie G, they call him. New England fishing village of I... Uh, this is a, basically a spin-off of House of the Dead. Place from which to witness unusual phenomena Actually, this is the original version of the SCP wiki. That's how they, like, redacted shit. So that's... I can see why this game is appreciated now. Mm-hmm. ...started, having gleaned what information one could from the British Museum... Was this written by the same guy as the other guy? I guess it was. Voiced by the same guy, right? Mm -hmm. One's work on space and comets in particular had met with a warm response, and one thought it due to... He sounds kind of like Saruman. ...original sketches <laughs> of the phenomenon, sketches which one felt were sure to arouse a great deal of keen interest in the... You know what, though? Like, the accents kind of get a little sharper around certain words. Yeah. It's like his heart... His Fuck heart was... Yeah, his heart wasn't in it. Editor's nice. note. Lord <laughs> Bolliskin's memoirs end at this point. Who knows what extraordinary <laughs> Two fucking pages! No, it's not me talking in a different voice. A visit to New England to dementia, followed by an early death in St. Andrew's Hospital. Hospital? <laughs> He'd forgotten it was going to be a question until near the end. That's, that's even more confusing than the last book! Here's what I think about your memory- oh. <laughs> you have a terrible arm. <laughs> he really does. I don't care about this record either. I don't either. think anybody in his family's ever gonna play football. Why did he throw why did he get rid of the record though? That could Oh we have a gramophone too. We could have combined items. But I guess not. No. That might be a trap knowing this game. There were certain like trap items things. That even if you think about using the game is unwinnable. Um I don't think it did oh, that. Oh the spider's there, waiting for you. There is there's some insta-kill items I know. So having those three arrows, I presume, is important. Oh, yeah. I think we have a bow, too, right? All right, spider bouncer. Ease up, bro. Whoa, that door just opened. I better back up. Hmm. Well, now that we can go Stupid to the cellar. Stupid spider will let me in. <laughs> Damn it, I keep running over my own thrown items. So you're going to have to get a spider disguise to sneak by that spider. Oh man. Hey, wait, what happened oh. to the music? I would have I would have thought the cellar would have been the scariest. What do you mean we don't have a wine cellar thing? <laughs> wait, yes we do. I have a bad feeling those rats actually hurt you. It's been a while since I played it. The rats own a musical sting machine. Oh, that's yeah. it. Ooh. Or they're subscribed to freesoundeffects.com. Either way. Oh, <laughs> Are we, is that the battle music for the rat? All right, I'll just take that block. The, the, so those can hurt you? Yeah, I'm remembering they can, yeah. Still a bit dramatic. Well, I mean, it was the 20s. They didn't have penicillin or anything like that. <laughs> did it knock them back? <laughs> they, there's a big fucking rats back there. That is then. a sick rat bite, man. Oh, damn it! 
Why are there so many fucking books? Throw the book at the rat. Read this! <laughs> September the 13th. <laughs> Whoa, that rat has a beautiful reading voice. <laughs> I, I got what I came for. All right, rat eagle. I'm done with you. <laughs> Just <laughs> hang out here. Go back to my better friends, the spiders. Woof, woof. <laughs> oh no, did you hear a rat? Oh no, those spiders, see them? <laughs> oh god, I hurt one. <laughs> I better read to keep myself calm. As reported by his faithful companion, Elisha Smith. Known amongst his fraternity by the awful name of Captain Ellie. Which fraternity, bro? Is it Sigma Chi? C-E-H. Gamma Epsilon. Uh, Woo! Uh, Woo! Elf. Yeah, yeah, you heard me, yeah. bro! Yeah! Spring break! Yeah. Buy all the devils, bro! Buy all the devils! Yeah. It'll take much more than every cannon in the blasted navy to make me change me mind. My mind. You're the greatest blackguard that ever joined our fraternity. Black guard. Am I not pregged? Captain of the Astarte, and bloodiest villain in all the seven seas. It's a seas. weird initiation ceremony. I thought you wanted to be known as Ellie Hell, sir. For your hazing, you're gonna have to listen to me read all of this. The Tribunal of the Corsair's Fraternity Whoa, treasure. murdered this. Pregged was indeed all he claimed. The judge, one-eyed William, slammed his fist on the table and silence was restored. Shut your mouth, Pregged! Really? He that's what I'm leaving his voice? Is he a hundred? Uh, You'll hang by the neck from a yard arm, you scurvy cur! <laughs> Were you hoping for some pirate fiction in the middle of this? His heart then stopped, yes. Me will. Many a man better than yourself has lived to regret... <laughs> then it becomes a trashy romance face. novel. You'll be I've always wanted to have pirates and courtroom world. dramas combined. That shook one-eyed William and no mistake. Danny waved is that a note for the editor? The and shouted, <laughs> Brext was always a loud mouth. The law says we hang him. The jurors okay, hire surprised. some voice actors to hang accompany him. your audiobook, please. It was Preg's turn to slam his fist on the table. <laughs> he threw <laughs> back his head. They're playing Hungry Hungry flat. Hippos. <laughs> so this is a creepypasta, right? <laughs> you yes. fools. You want to kill what will never die? Try it. Once more. <laughs> so I, I think that was the pirate we murder. fought. There was unease I guess. One-eyed William? Yeah. This, I, I'm, I'm hoping that it is, because that means this whole book is meant to explain one fucking enemy in the whole game. <laughs> Once too often, it was night, and a bitter wind whipped the New England coast. Day 43! Snug inside the Dead Horse Inn, one of the He looks up all the rats and spiders are reading over his, his shoulder. His name was Chuck. Next time, on Night Pirate Court. Black magic. He told stories of human sacrifices, voodoo rites, and zombies. <laughs> he told a story about a mansion a a about, with a detective who read a book in which and then it becomes like a whole circular thing like oh, Inception. Wow. Priggs went missing. When he returned he shouted, Tis the devil that guides us now, me hearties. Well, the devil has a weird vocabulary. Was true or not, <laughs> the Astarte began <laughs> Whether that was true or not, we'll leave the possibility <laughs> open. I mean, you never know, right? The song of the Astartes' men, Crash the Bones, was replaced by a new one. Them Bones by Alice in Chains. The skull, go oh. to Port Saber, to starboard. Pass Look over that will, and with death you'll deal. If you cut a rope, cut the right, I hope. Should I be snapping my fingers along with this poem? The death you will find. The next day, cut the right rope. Got it. Missed. Puzzle solved. The next anyway, day, was he was kicked out of the poetry slam. Plunged between his shoulder blades. Uh, this, this author's not very confident. He's like, as you may have guessed. The, grin. Molten the next page. You buying this so far? Down his throat. <laughs> Whatever way things happened next, and I don't have the details. Oh, you know what I just noticed? We're not actually. It's not. It's no longer a book. Actually, it's like a pile of papers. Oh. I think we're reading a screenplay. Or you're flipping the same piece of paper over and over again. It's different each time. It's magic. They carried large wooden chests with them. Two days later, we heard shots being fired and screams. 
I kind of lost track of this. Arrived soon after that and claimed so is this still about pirates? Or is it still explaining the one enemy you've encountered? He alone managed I think it's like way over explained it. Like I didn't need this backstory. Right, like, Hideo, that paper in the garbage. Hideo Kojima would be like, alright, alright, let's cut this a little bit. <laughs> I was given command of the Estarte, while Prext handed three chests over to the crew. Oh, the is that like uh, the Zelda thing where you try to get the money out of the the one chest? Or? The oh yeah. That night and the stars shone bright. All the in oh. I noticed a <laughs> Every fucking page turn, I'm looking like, don't be a right arrow, don't be a right arrow. Here is a hearty mate. What's cruelest of all is there's no escape button. You just can't quit in the middle of it. He could no. tell. Pregs laughed loudly and held up a roll of parchment. <laughs> and his hideout. Oh, so he, the other, uh, the reader just remembered a funny joke. <laughs> the parchment fell to the ground. <sighs> the unrolling. I noticed I hate what this seemed game. to be a map of underground. But no, seriously, it's just a, a classic. A maze um. of caverns. Pregst continued. I'm giving up the pirate's life. The Astartes What other games besides Resident Evil did this game inspire? <laughs> Uh, a lot of visual novels. <laughs> I'm leaving you only because I found a treasure more precious than the purest of gold. <laughs> Is it reading? Because the game seems to like that. Keith spoke to him then. Damn it, there's a new character! <laughs> Damn it, Keith! They are ready and we must go. The stranger turned No, I'm not running out of voices. And said in a soft, <laughs> chilling voice. Sometimes Bricks talks too much! <laughs> oh. Talks too much. Forget what he just said. And maybe. Oh, I've forgotten all of this, don't worry. Yeah, don't worry about it. The fellow's words froze the There's no arrow. my bones. And it was all. Yes! Oh, we made normal. it! I'll not breathe a word. The canoe slid away into the night. Their torches disappeared. I, I the know Alone in the Dark the 3 didn't have the reading. I'm My hoping 2 doesn't. So will any of this be important later? Were there any gameplay clues no. embedded in that narrative at all? I think Cut the Rope on the Right was the only thing that seemed remotely like a gameplay Oh, wait. Oh, no. We were briefly No, no, he died of old age in the time it took no. to read that.